Hey, Terry. I need to see you at the end of your shift, okay? I want to tell your little ragamuffin friend over there that she needs to actually order something or leave. Hey, girl. Marina says you need to order something. She just mad that she tried to fuck my daddy and he ain't want that old dried up cooney mooney. Ugh. I ain't trying to hear all that, okay? What you want? I didn't bring any money. I got you. Cool. You know what I like. Check her out. The fuck? Didn't she quit like a month ago? Yeah. Looks like her new dude's keeping her lace. What the fuck am I doing wrong? <laughs> Dating raggedy ass dudes like Jerome? How many kids he got? All right. Like four? <laughs> Man, fuck Jerome and his fertile ass, okay? <laughs> hey, Nikki. How you been? Terry. You look good. Thank you, girl. I've been good. Real good. Um, this is Cody. Have they given you more thought about what we talked about? Ray's friend keeps asking if they know any good friends to hook him up with. He's a real good pot. Potential. Potential? My ass. Look, I told you, I'm not a prostitute, okay? A prostitute? <laughs> Girl, bye. Come on. Street hookers could never look as spy as me. Plus, taxes can be filed in my job. I consider myself like a personal trainer or a maintenance woman. What? I improve the quality of life for a man through companionship. And he's paying me handsomely for it. Sometimes you fuck, sometimes you don't. All in what you want to put up with. Plus, where did fucking a guy like Jerome get you? Look, I ain't putting up with no old ass dick, okay? I could use money, but I don't know about dating an old dude for it, okay? Besides, I think I was get this promotion, so, you know, thanks for the offer, but I'll be alright. Fuck it. Whatever. Hit me up when you're tired of struggling and ready to send your mom out like she's the queen of fucking England. Excuse you. Ugh, where the fuck is my food? I'm parched sitting out there with that creepy bitch standing me up and down and shit. And what Nikki want? You know she ain't up to no good. She ain't never up to no good. Mario 
In the pilot episode, Nikki is actually the one who introduces Terry to the sugar baby lifestyle. And, you know, Nikki thinks that it's just helping out a friend. You know, she thinks it's just nothing of it, it's no big deal. But, you know, in reality, she's really throwing her best friend or ex-best friend into the lion's den.